When we started this venture, we had no idea where it would bring us. But now that we've seen all that God has done, we can't wait to see where we'll go next. In 2009, God gave us a vision to become a church for the unchurched in Hattiesburg. God moved us to the Lincoln Road campus when the financial recession had just hit, and he also led us to make some changes. These changes went against everything tradition told us was normal. We lost some folks, and it hit us hard. We made a lot of cutbacks. The staff took pay cuts, spending was frozen. If something didn't happen soon, we were sunk but we stayed true to the vision God had given us. God began to bless our faithfulness. We were seeing growth by 30 and 40%, pushing us to be one of the fastest growing churches in America. God showed up and He showed out. He strengthened our vision to be a church for the unchurched, and the unchurched started showing up from all over. People were coming to know Jesus, to really know Him. Lives were being changed marriages were being healed and families were being put back together. We quickly began to run out of room and we began to realize we can't just stay here. We have to venture out. If we want to reach the lost and broken of our city, we have to go. We're not sure where, but we have to go. God provided a location. The Hunt Club, a broken down nightclub with a history of violence and a story of addiction and pain. It was a shell of a building and when you walked in, you could practically feel the horrible things that had happened there. But that's the beauty of God's work. The building He provided was a perfect picture of the people we were called to reach. God doesn't want perfect people, the people who have it all together. He wants the broken down, the stained, the leaky roofs, and the empty on the inside. He takes the broken down and fixes them. He takes the old bones and breathes new life into them. He takes the filth and disgust of the past and writes a new story. He takes the pain and brokenness and paints a story of redemption. He takes the unwanted and reclaims them. With the Hunt Club campus now open, we were beginning to reach new people, people whose lives were truly being reclaimed and repurposed for the glory of God. All along, as the Hunt Club campus continued to grow, we stayed true to the mission God had given us. Only now we were beginning to realize maybe we needed to stretch our faith even more. Maybe the vision God had given us was not only for Hattiesburg, but beyond. God began to open doors for us in Stone County. We knew nothing about the area, but God sent us people who did, people to join the Venture family, who were passionate about reaching their community, and who wanted their friends, family, and neighbors to know, love, and follow Jesus. And then he provided a location to help reach the people of Stone County and beyond. God blessed our efforts the most when we didn't know what we were doing, when we didn't know where we were going, when we were weak so that he could be strong. Hebrews 11.8 says, By faith Abraham, when called to a place he would later receive as his inheritance, obeyed and went, even though he did not know where he was going. Venture Out is a movement, a movement to love others by serving them. The ignition of your generosity through serving and giving can have an incredible impact on the lives of people in our community and beyond. By caring for physical needs of people, we are given a platform to present an eternal hope found only in Jesus. Venture Out is a movement to rescue and reclaim we believe God is calling us to reach 10,000 people, one person at a time. Venture Out is a movement to new places. Your generosity helps fuel growth and resources for God's work in new communities, new facilities, and new people. Venture Out is a movement of faith to strengthen our own relationships with Jesus and put our hearts in tune with His. When we started this venture, we had no idea where it would bring us. But now that we've seen all that God has done, we can't wait to see where it will go next. In obedience, we follow. By faith, we go.